Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to lock messages in Google Messages. Now, many Android devices come with a built-in app lock feature that allows you to secure apps with a PIN password pattern or biometric authentication. All right, and here is how to set it up. That's if you want to utilize your device's built-in app lock feature just go ahead and open the settings app so open the settings app in your phone which we want to do right now and navigate to biometrics and security which we have here and once you click on that, just head over to um, lock screen or um, security folder. I'll specifically go to app security. And once you click on app security, you can now turn on app protection or Google Play Protect and follow the prompt to add messages as part of um, the application to, you know, to secure. So just go ahead and follow the prompt to do that. Now access. Now once you do that, access to messages app within secure folder will require authentication. All right. Then another step is to enable end-to-end -end encryption in Google Messages. Now Google Messages actually support end-to-end -end encryption for one-on-one -on -one conversations when both users have rcs that's rich communication services chat features enabled now this ensures that only you and the recipients can read the message so to enable rcs and e2ee -E, just open the google messages app tap your profile picture at the top right corner and select a messages settings and once you do that tap rcs chat and toggle it on so once you toggle it on it's going to turn blue so from there follow the prompts to verify your phone number and once rcs is enabled and you're chatting with someone who also has rcs enabled you'll see a lock icon next to the send button indicating that the conversation is end-to-end -end encrypted likewise you can use third party messages app messaging apps with built-in lock features like signal telegram and even whatsapp so go over to tutorial from the top to the bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you'll be good to go. I hope this tutorial marvelously helped your search.